and so on. So you see that it's going to change uh, in relation to the number of units. That's the point of us breaking it out uh, in terms of a contribution margin type of income statement. So that gives us a contribution margin of the 52, which is the 100,000 minus the 48. And that gives us our 52 contribution margin. And then the fixed costs do not change. They're fixed. So kind of like the rent, the, the depreciation, the supplies, the insurance, they are what they are. And then if we add those up, the total fixed costs, 44,100. And the contribution margin, the 52 minus the fixed cost of 44100 gives us that 7,900 of the uh, income from operations we saw in the prior income statement that was formatted in a traditional fashion. Now with a flexible budget, we can then do this for different income levels. So what if we had, what, what if, not income levels, but production levels. So what if we had 12,000 units then? 